going to show you how to write verbose messages to the console in PowerShell. The way we do that is with the commandlet write verbose. However, by default, the verbose setting, verbose dollar verbose preference, is set to silently continue. And with that, it will not write the verbose message out to the screen. I'll show you what I mean. So if I execute that write verbose command with the default verbose setting, it's not going to display anything to the screen. However, if I change the dollar verbose preference to continue, then when we execute the write verbose commandlet, it does output to the screen. So that's a quick way that you can use uh, write verbose to write verbose messages. However, you can also use this in your own functions. So you just have to make your function advanced function by adding commandlet binding and param and that will give you the common parameters and one of those co common parameters is verbose so i can show you what i mean i'll execute this code and put this function in the memory and when we execute this function it does its regular output but it will not write verbose if i use the common parameter dash verbose then it will output the verbose commands. One important thing to know is that the verbose output is a separate stream from your regular output. You can use this to your advantage if you want to display messages to the user, but you want to also collect the output of that command, the regular output. So this function here uh, outputs hello world to the regular output stream, and then to the verbose output stream, it outputs hello friends so if i execute this and put the output to a variable here for example dollar a we still see the verbose output and the contents of dollar a we can see our hello world so an interesting use of verbose that's our quick intro to verbose